So, this is my Troy built Prison Stratton powered mulching lawnmower. Uh, this is in its 23rd summer. Uh, in the past, say, oh, maybe 10 years, I haven't changed oil, I've just added oil. But she keeps running. And uh, I have it set fairly low. I'm kind of giving the lawn a little bit of a scalping here because I have a really large oak tree that drops a lot of leaves and I'll show you the front here you can see the lawn last summer we had a cesspool collapse just about where that yellow bird feeder post is and after deciding to redo the whole front we did a garden up front <coughs> put up a new vinyl fence did the grasses that are over there. I got myself a nice Norwegian blue spruce, I think it's called. And uh, we planted some arborvitaes, put a little bird bath out, repaired the water system, the sprinkler system. And my objective now is to, and you can see the difference between cut and uncut. It's not like it's that really overgrown. It's, I haven't been watering now for a few weeks because it's just uh, the end of the season and we've been getting some rain. The noises you hear going by are just traffic. I get a lot of traffic in the daytime. Let me see if I can say hello. Uh, just a quickie. Um, wanted to update, give a little bit of an update on the yard and how I'm setting up for the fall and going into the winter. Um, but this is uh, this is the new. This is the not the new, but this is the way I'm cutting it now, so that the the leaves will hopefully be taken by Mother Nature onto greener pastures. Let's see, I'm going to give it one pull and see what happens. It's not so easy with one hand holding the, the camera. Let's see. Not too bad for 23 years and maybe one spark plug and an air filter over the years. Although, I have to admit, it did take a little starter fluid. Alright, I'll finish up some more later in the back. Bye. which is going to be the backyard. I'm trying to, I can't see anything, so I'm looking at my, the back of my cell phone. I'm not doing it in selfie mode. But um, I'm doing a final cut. Not a final cut, but you can see the difference in before and after. And uh, I'm just trying to get this cut down. I've been cutting and bagging it and throwing it into a mulch pile all summer. I thought, well, maybe I should leave a little down. I've got all kinds of different grasses growing, uh, lots of clover, uh, just all kinds of stuff. I see some dandelions. Of course, now that it's cut, I guess it's not as easy. Let's go over here. You can see that there's uh, <coughs> plenty of clover here. There's some long shoot stuff. Let's see if I can find some. Yeah, here. This kind of stuff here has got like a seed pod to it. The girls seem to be liking that. But otherwise it's basically green. I'm not doing a chicken tractor, although I think next year I will. All right, later. All right, here's some of the different grasses. You can see 
that there's this, which I believe is just dandelion. Well, I'm not sure. There's clover. All right. There's uh, some other stuff in here too. If anybody can tell me what it is, you know, I'll uh, get in a little close. There's all kinds of stuff in here though. Some of it's brown, some of it's green. There's bugs everywhere. Of course, they're all turned up right now because of the lawn being cut. Not exactly a quiet place here, Long Island. You can see there's helicopters flying around somewhere in the view. There he is. Nothing like a little corn on the cob. The girls definitely like the corn on the cob. And uh, for me, well, I came, I bought this house and it came with a bottle opener, or should I say, I bought a bottle opener. It came with a house. New Belgian flat tire. It's got my name all over it. So the girls are having a snack. They're going to relax out here for a little while. The lawn is cut. Hopefully, well, they probably won't be obsessed with the corn for a little while. But maybe they'll find some bugs. Lawn's all cut. Looking nice and green. It's kind of a beautiful day. We still have green in the, in the trees. We still have green in the trees. And uh, you can see some puffy clouds. Just a nice day. All right, that's it for the October mid-October cleanup.